small for the amount of people always uh, being here. Um, but that's another story. All right. I guess this is match. Hand warmers are done. 50 euro money match. Super Goomba as Peach against Han Yuki. And people start screaming. All right. So what I've heard, this is a prior... Uh, ooh! Close, close, close. It's nerves. The nerves are starting. Speaking of close, the Super Goomba guy is super close to the TV. <laughs> <laughs> he sure is, UCK. He sure is. <laughs> he has, like, bad eyesight, so you can't blame him. Minus six. Really? Oh, I see. Oh. Yeah, hello. Ah, yeah, there we go. Up. Yeah, so uh, you were saying he has bad eyesight. Yeah, he's like, uh, he's, his face is always uh, close to the screen. Super mm. Goomba. But he's not wearing glasses, or does he have uh, contact lenses? It's just in one eye, I think. I'm not sure. Mm. Very bad eyesight, but you can't blame him. Yeah, because uh, he's, he's practically inside the TV. Oh! Wobble, yeah. baby, wobble, oh, baby, wobble, wobble baby, wobble, go. yeah. There we have it. Thank you. Alright, that's a lot of percent. He knows the stuff. He can finish it. Alright. So this matchup. Oh! From zero! From zero. Alright, see you later, anyway. And next commentator. Oh, he dropped it! He dropped it. All right, so this matchup is notorious for being um, in Peacher advantage. This is a, a really strong counter pick against the ICs, namely because you're not gonna miss your L cancel off after a float, which is uh, which usually happens when you hit both shields with an aerial for every character in this game. Uh, it just throws your timing for L, L canceling off guard, and also uh, down smashes just wrecks uh, ice climbers in general. Just just everything they want to do, down smashes the way to counter it. Hello, I'm here too. Yeah, I'm, I'm joined here with Le uh, Le Leo. Uh, what's your game tag again? I only know your real name. 30 pounds. Oh yeah, you changed it to 30 pounds. Yes. Uh, I, love the, I love the nickname. Yes. Ooh, ooh, he drops it again. That's too bad. I'm here to look at how um, how our regional players are doing. Yeah, the, um, I was asking asking you pay earlier. Do you know Do you know more about the history between these two? What is the occasion of 50 euro money match? These two are what you call the trash talk kings of uh, North Brabant. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, where we have one upcoming ice climbers in uh, Han Yuki and uh, one person who is, does not agree with this uh, with this statement. Okay. In uh, Super Goomba. That is Super Goomba. All right. Yeah. And uh, Han Yuki has been climbing the ranks uh, within Brabant uh, for a while now, and um, Bim has uh, anyway, Super Goomba. Yeah. Has been proving his worth in the meantime. All right. And the last time they met in bracket, Pim actually uh, actually convincingly took the took the set. Super Goomba won the set. All right. Yes. Super Goomba. No, that's all right. He's just used to calling yeah. it real names. Yeah, yeah. We all know about that. Uh, Ooh. And now um, now we've got the Hanyuki after his improvements, and after he made all the upsets uh, within our region. I see. And uh, Super Goomba really wants to. Clear up that he is not as great yeah, yeah. as we think he is. He's trying to deny the t title of Haru uh, Yuki as upcoming yes. player, upcoming yes. player. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Yeah. Uh, so this is a really rare side for me to see that the Ice Climbers is in the lead against Peach. I only see this matchup uh, at the highest level. Um, it's, it's definitely not a common matchup, but Peach is definitely a common counter pick uh, against Ice Climbers. But these two characters are both uh, bo both mains, of the yeah. two players. Um, it's gonna be best of five, probably no bans. Uh, 50 euros is a lot of money, man. That's, that's a, lot a lot of money, man. It's a lot of money. It's basically, basically the regional equivalent. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You just gave us selling. It's, it's, it's like 200 or 300 dollars or something. This, this <laughs> is basically the regional equivalent of the of the money match we saw between Levin and Esfat. <laughs> yes, yes. It's a, it's about thousand dollars. Yes, something like that. So earlier today, I actually played Hanyuki to to kind of gauge his chances to win. Okay. Used uh, used my secondary peach on him. And uh, what I saw was uh, was pretty good. Hmm. Seems he really um, 
really understands how to how to approach the at least the peach of this level and uh, how to prevent uh, prevent them from coming in for free. Yeah, I know that as well. He's he's getting a, a lot of grabs in neutral. He hasn't con he has converted maybe half of them so far, but he is getting ooh, a lot of grabs. And you do not want to hold down on low percentages as Ice Slammers against Peach because that is an easy 60% right there. Definitely. We're gonna probably be seeing from uh, Han Yuki that he's trying to bait out approaches from. Super nice Goomba, setup. Such as that. Setup with the blizzard. Because he knows. He knows Super Goomba wants to go in. Yeah, yeah. So what, what Super Goomba can do there is, uh, of course, don't get hit. That, that's the first thing you should do. Don't get hit. If you if you are going to get hit or a shield, if you know you have been hit, you have to smash the eye. And this blizzard has a lot of hits, so you can smash the eye the blizzard a ton because of the multiple hits. Um, and Super Goomba did not do it that time, so I, I'm going to keep an eye out for if he's going to smash the eye the next time, because that's that's a really good way to uh, avoid getting grabbed after getting hit by the blizzard. From my experience, Super Goomba does not regularly employ uh, SDI. SDI. So that, uh, that might prove a problem for him uh, if he if he really wants to the win this set Ooh. and take his 50 euros. How did he get a grab? Was it not, was it not a float cancel? It, it, it seemed like he missed an elf cancel or his shield popped up, or I don't know what... what it was a float cancel, Yeah, but he hit it too high. He hit it so high on the shield that, uh, that and didn't fast fall it, so that uh, Anyuki actually had enough time to grab him. You sure? Really? I'm pretty sure. Anyuki is very, very quick with his uh, with uh, his grabs. With his like grabs. He, yeah, he, yeah. he knows he knows his timings, and once he and once he has you, he's usually very effective at converting that. The nerves are definitely playing right now for both guys. What Anyuki usually tries to do is to, to really upset his opponents, mm. get them frustrated, make them make them commit to things they do not want to commit to. Oh, get them and actually uh, upset, not not going for the upset, but getting them upset. Oh, yes, really? oh, yes, I that'll help him get him, get more uh, get more grabs. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. And, uh, and Super Goomba prides himself on um, not getting rattled by that. Mm. But as we can see, um, Anyuki doesn't necessarily need that. No. Indeed, indeed. So there's a there, in the history of Smash, there has been a lot of controllers thrown to the gro ground after being wobbled occasionally, often. Um, not sure if we're going to see that to get today, but uh, perhaps another day. But wobbles are definitely happening right now. Wobbles, yeah. What I'm not seeing from Han Yuki as much is uh, trying to cover uh, Super Goomba's higher approaches with mm. uh, which uh, short up up airs. Yeah, I'd, yeah, really yeah. Like I'd really like to see more of that. Definitely, definitely. Definitely low percentages you can connect uh, with uh, both Popo and Ani. You can connect the up air into back air for a easy, what is it, 35 to 40 percentage. Yep. Which is a lot of damage uh, from zero. Those double hammers, they hit hard. Yeah, double. Oh, that was a bomb! He was going for the Al Akbar, but it didn't hit. Sadly, it did not hit. He doesn't really go want to go for the true Al Akbar with the standings right now. Ooh, caught him dashing away with bad DI. And this, this is where this is where Hanyuki shines. He's yeah. really now he has him in a spot where he absolutely cannot get frustrated. What I, what I don't like is uh, Super Goomba is, is is usually approaching with with her with his back, uh, with with back airs instead of forward airs. Uh, and yeah, yes. he, he is throwing a lot of turnips. That's good, but you can just go in with the turnip into forward air. And you either get a hit or they shield, and you still have the shield pressure because you're Peach. And he he doesn't. It doesn't seem like he knows or he's scared of something. But he's I not. He's not doing that. He's not I think Super Goomba doesn't uh, doesn't entirely trust the wind up of the fair yet. Yeah, something like that. I, I rarely see him using fairs in general. He probably he probably does know that it's better and that it has the the required shield stun. Mm. But he thinks he thinks he's just going to get uh, get hit into a wobble setup or something yeah, out, exactly. of a, out of the wind up. He's just he's just scared. The, yeah. the the UK people like to call it the fear. The, the fear. He's scared. <laughs> Shout out to UK. Yeah, this match is uh, looking a lot closer though. Yeah, that's the counter backup. Got the eye once again, but the percentage wasn't high enough. So we'll move yeah. by lifts to tell the tail. Probably do it soon enough. We don't see him there. Yes, yes, there it is. Clean, clean edge guard. One stuck to one. Super Goomba can't really afford to go for any trades now. Ooh, that's a stitch. Oh, take it. That's and 44. He, lose. he loses the stitch. Sorry for screaming, ladies and gentlemen. I was too hyped. <laughs> the 
hype man. He is always hype. Yes, sir. Oh, wow. That was He's insane. A nice little mix up from Hanyuki. With the smash throw and the smash attack. Yeah, exactly. He knows his D things. Yes. That is a thing he's very practiced in. He knows a set, a set number of these things he knows extremely well. Oh! And that's game two. Fifty euros, man. It's fifty euros. Fifty euros on the line. At, at first, it looked uh, for a moment there at Super Goomba was uh, was letting him get into his head. Hmm. But then, then he's smiling again. So. Uh, very don't don't expect to go. Uh, don't expect to see him go down just yet. Oh, in, he's, he's taking out the secondary with Daisy. Ooh, Ooh. He's, he, Daisy does know fair. Yeah, he, she does know the attack with the crown on her head. Before that. Ooh, wow, that was definitely a missed out cancel into get grabbed. Wobbles are happening right now. I yeah. think we saw we saw uh, Bim, uh, Super Goomba trying to mash out still after the wobble had yeah, already yeah, started. Yeah, definitely. Should, should probably tell him that that doesn't do anything. Fair enough. But what it do, what it does do is uh, your opponent who is doing the wobble uh, next to you does get kind of uh, nervous if the people if the person next to him mashes. There's this one moment uh, everybody knows the Daigo moment, right? Where yeah, he, yeah, he yeah. power shields every. Uh, every move from the uh, the super attack from Chun Li, which is Justin Wong, uh, uh, evil moment. What is it? 37, 38? I don't know. I don't know the exact number. Uh, but Justin Wong, while he is getting comboed by the Ryu, uh, or while right, right oh, sorry, while Justin Wong is doing all the uh, what's it called? All the parries, right? While yep. he's doing all the parries, uh, he's actually mashing because he knows he knows he's gonna get hit afterwards, and he's mashing not necessarily to do anything in game, but to throw his opponent off guard. Yeah, those are the. Those are the real um, Western fighting game tactics where yeah. we have setups that are uh, that have the players side by side, so they can try to distract each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's a real interesting discussion because in the East uh, they indeed have uh, separate setups where you are across each other on the TV. So tactics like that, like throwing your opponent off guard by maybe sitting really close to them or uh, mashing on your controller won't work because they won't won't simply see it. I was just going to say that this match was looking a lot closer than before, but uh, just as I say that... Just as you say that. Just as I say that twice. Daisy is getting pounded. Ooh, but she gets out. Well, forget what I said about the mashing. Apparently it is working, right? Could be the nurse from Hanyuki. Oh yeah, yeah, he's definitely thinking about those 50 euros. He does He does have a lesser, lesser mental game in that aspect than uh, Super Goomba. Oh, I see. So if he can't get the opponent nervous enough, he might get nervous himself. Ooh, I think we just saw an SD and that kind of yeah. brings it tied up. That might be a bad sign for Hanyuki. Oh, you don't want to dash it in. Ooh, he gets away with it. Lifts the tail to tail, apparently. Down smash, yes. Oh, and living. All right, that's, that's exactly what I want to see. I want to see more edge guards from Super Goomba, especially separating them first and then going for the edge like this. This yes. is it, but then not getting hit by the forward smash. Yes. But that's exactly how it should I feel be. like the dash attack wasn't really the, uh, the best option there. No, definitely not. Just, Maybe just some, something float cancel there or something. Yeah, just go off stairs, do one there. It can be a soft there, it's enough. Nana dies, you go back on stage. Neutral. Ooh. The grinder, the, the washing machine, the blender. You have, any, you have any, <laughs> any, any more words for the downside? There used to be so much more, I forget all of them. I believe there was actually a threat on Smash Boards uh, with all the nicknames called for the down smash. Is the, is the MACD smash still a thing? Yeah, probably. The MACD smash. I personally love the washing machine. It seems about accurate. Ooh, clank, clank. In, uh, in this washing what? machine, Nana is the socks. <laughs> exactly. The socks might come out pink, who knows? We might be seeing a, a turn of the tides in this match. 50 euro, baby. 50 euro. Think about all the cash. Now I wonder if Anyuki is being nervous oh, wow. already Super, right now Super or already Goomba focusing on his counter pick. Super Goomba. Oh, that might be it. That might I, be it. It might, it might also not be. Anyuki can still drop this. Think about the rhythm. Think about the rhythm. Staying alive. Uh, 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 staying alive. That's the rhythm. It's the finisher I'm That's worried about. Oh, the forward throw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. 
50 euros, baby. All right. And Han Yuki takes it 3-0. Yeah, that was Showing that why was he good, is the one good. climbing up the ranks. That was good. Yeah, now that uh, the, the tournaments nowadays are running more uh, smoothly in this venue, we can also do... Uh